Staff cigarette breaks could be stubbed out by Nottingham County Council. Employees have been warned that if they are caught lighting up during work hours or in their uniform, they could be disciplined. Now, Hilary, you, you obviously you run a company, you've, you've got employees. Definitely. Is this something that well, you would I'm, I'm quite you mixed a about idea? this because... You know, I don't know how you, you forbid somebody who does smoke yeah. to say you can't actually smoke at all during the hours or whatever the working hours do um, are. Having said that, they do it in hospitals and they get by, don't they, with nicotine patches, whatever aid they choose to use. Mm. And I also think it's quite... I mean, you know, our smoking centre at work, because we thought we were being clever and we'd move it to the... I mean, the building, the head office is like three miles long so kind of that they put the smoking shelter behind the building so it's hidden out of sight it's actually become the staff boardroom you know I think all the, <laughs> the business are made in this smoking sense uh, shelter so uh, it's also unfair to the people who don't smoke and if I then had all the people leaving the business because they decided they want a break, yeah. uh, but they don't smoke, then... Nothing would get like, done. It must so, be, it must in be a way, so I hope Nottingham City Council that you do succeed and any of my employees watching this, beware, because we might follow suit. <laughs> <laughs> I, I mean, I don't know, I don't work in an office, but I imagine if I was sat in an office and somebody was getting up four or five times a day to go off, have a chat, have a gossip, have a giggle, have a fag, mm. I would get, like, really fed up with that. I mean, if that's their right to do it, then what about having another shelter where you can do, go and do ten minutes exercise? Because you need to be healthy and you need to yeah, do, have five little spurts would be empty. of exercise. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but I mean, I was I loved smoking. Smoking, I always say it's the lover I never wanted to say goodbye to. I miss him every day. Um, but and, and when I was a smoker, I was the selfish, most selfish person. I wouldn't have even thought about whether it was fair on anybody else. That's what I used to do. But I think that we know how bad it is for people. We know it's not fair on the other people that can't go and have a fag. So why don't we just? You know, but stop obviously, it. You know, it's not that easy. In your one... lunch break, but if, the, if it was we... that easy, do you think there'd be anybody smoking today? Do you yeah. think the cigarettes have become one of the fastest growing companies in yeah. the world? It's the it hardest thing I've ever done was give up smoking. It and really took that's me years. The other thing. Do you allow mm. e-cigarettes to be smoked in no. the building? No. no. Why not? No. Because I don't know. Because then they'd. <laughs> <laughs> You know, the, the you see, the board, obviously... none of the board, I'm the only one that smokes on the mm. board. OK. So none of our board of directors smoke. So I suppose they're oblivious to the smoke breaks and mm. to e-cigarettes, but I just know that they don't allow e-cigarettes. So if it was banned in your business, plan. would you not go out for a fag either? No. You would? Probably it's no, quite interesting, though, because no. what they're doing... What the... I'm that engrossed in work when I go in. No, I don't think about cigarettes. Yeah. Mm. What, what the council is doing, which I think is quite clever, is that they're doing it from a health perspective. That's just so they're, they're not saying, saying yeah. you know, we don't want you to do this because you're not spending your time at your desk working. They're actually saying, as a council, it's our responsibility to keep, you know... Uh, that's a bit of a big to, brother, to give, though, I, I know, that I know but that, that, I think, it's is the way around the kind of the human rights issue, maybe. Yeah, I don't yeah. think I'd get away with that. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's also interesting as well, as in some of them, it's not necessarily saying that you're not allowed to, but they're making it really difficult to do it. Um, the, apparently, they're saying if you work in highways, for example, if you want to smoke, you need to take off all your uniform, go as far away from the site as possible, have smoke a cigarette... Smoke naked. Get <laughs> <pain>. <laughs> Naked smoking, this is a thing. Do you know? This could take off. Or more people would, would give up because of nasty burns. Yeah. <laughs> Not to mention mm. the arrest for public indignity. <laughs> <laughs>